Hello, dears. Welcome to Beauty for Heart. I'm Liling, as nice as Nelu. Today, I'll be sharing with you the three makeup products PD review. This video will be a short one. I'll be doing these product swatches, demo, and also my review. I hope that this short duration will be easily digestible for you. And I actually hope that this video can be around three minutes duration. The reason for the short duration of this video is, after all, TikTok has trained us to watch short videos. And if you dears are new to my channel, hello and welcome. I love to explore new cruelty-free makeup products from the drugstore brands, indie, clean beauty brands, and Sephora brands. So hopefully this video can help you to select better which are the appropriate products for you and your favorite colors. Saving you the time, money, effort, and headaches to browse through tons of products out there on the market. So if you happen to like this video, please consider to subscribe. Thank you. And now let's get started. I bought this mini primer from the Cult Beauty website. The standard international thread delivery purchase amount for Cult Beauty is £40. It comes in a tube form like this, so just squeeze out the amount. The texture is thick and creamy. Probably if you just can see that it's shimmer with a slight gold glow. Under the lightings, the shimmers reflect the lights and make my skin more glowy and healthy. It doesn't come with any scent. I realized this primer has a mattifying effect on my face. It helps to smoother my pores and give a soft, focused, blurry look on my skin. I will definitely consider to repurchase the full size after finishing this mini size. I bought this from Cine Grace website. By the way, dears, I will link all the websites mentioned in the description box below for your convenience. The overseas shipping to Singapore is about 14 USD depending on the weight. So this is the cream eyeshadow. It has a thick texture. Just use a little bit at a time. And if you find that it's not enough, then you can build it up. When applied on the eyes, the cream shadow dries down quickly. So just work with one eye first, then the other. When I apply this cream shadow on the eyes, I will usually use my finger to apply on the eyes first then use this kind of detailed brush to blend in the inner corners. My eyelid is oily. After the cream eyeshadow dries down on the eyelid, it doesn't move at all and remains in place for the whole day. This cream eyeshadow is not waterproof but it's smudge proof. On my eyelid, it doesn't fade, it doesn't crease. The color payoff is intense. This cream eyeshadow is glittery on the eyes, it's very beautiful. So far, I enjoy the colors and this is easy to work around on the eyes. So definitely, I will keep a lookout for more colors during the sales. I don't think I can finish this whole tube because this is quite a large tube. I just hope that probably in the future, if it's possible, Sydney Grace can come out with the mini version. I bought this from Beautylish. The free international shipping amount is USD $100. And I bought this lipstick just to top up to the free international shipping. The packaging is very simple. It comes with a square glossy black tube with the Wayne Goss logo over here. And this is the pull-up type. I thought this should be the magnetic type but it's a pull-up type. And when we pull up, you can find the logo Wayne Goss all over the cylinder over here. And the bottom sticker shows the color name. This Wayne Goss Luxury Cream Lipstick is very, very moisturizing, creamy, and shiny. It is one of the most comfortable lipstick formula I have worn. It is more comfortable than the Charlotte Tilbury moisturizing lipsticks. The color payoff is quite sheer, but it's buildable. On the lips, this Luxury Cream Lipstick feels thick, but in a good way and feel very luxury. It is like applying butter on the lips. This moisturizing feels lasts the whole day, even when all the colors fade to nothing. With a creamy lipstick, the color will disappear after a meal. Absolutely love the moisturizing feel of this lipstick. Love the formula. It's a great lipstick. Definitely will also look out for more colors. Overall, I'm very happy with these three purchases. 
and I hope that these short videos can help you dears to decide better whether you want to get these three products if you have been eyeing them for quite some time. Now dears, it's your turn to share with me. What latest makeup products have you bought recently? Please comment in the comment section below. Thank you so much. And last but not least, here's an inner beauty tip for us to be more beautiful and more wise. Devote today to something so daring, even you can't believe you're doing it. Thank you so much for watching, dears. If you like this video, please subscribe to my channel and click the bell notification buttons for my future videos. I like to do beauty products review videos and if this is your cup of tea, please join in my YouTube family. May you dears have a peaceful, blissful and joyful week ahead. See you next time. Bye! And before you go, please watch these two videos over here. Thank you!